Hello. Nice to see you again. Today I'm going to show you how to use Flytape 2 to affect external audio, such as a desktop DAW, or a Roland SP404. In this video, the Zoom H5 will be used as my audio interface for my desktop DAW, Reason. And the Novation Audio Hub will be used as my audio interface for my iPad, using the app, AUM. Keep in mind, that any audio interface, desktop or iOS DAW, can be used, and the same methods will apply. Once your audio interfaces are all hooked up and ready to go. Let's begin with desktop audio. I will go from the line out of the desktop audio interface, to the inputs of the iPad audio interface. If your audio interface or device, does not have more than one dedicated output, you can always use the headphone output. Once that's all set, launch EUM. Tap the plus button, and then select audio. Tap source, and then select hardware input. The audio interface you have connected to your iPad will be shown here. Now I will select my audio interface. Now tap the insert and effects button. Then tap audio unit extension, and select Flytape 2. Tap the Flytape 2 icon to open the app, and now you're all set. Now any audio going out of your desktop, can be affected by Flytape 2 with an AUM. It's also worth mentioning. You can now record the affected audio. First arm your track, then tap the record button. All of your recordings will be saved in the recordings folder, which can be found in the files folder within the menu. You can also record the audio directly back to your desktop. Simply go from any available output, from the iPad's audio interface, to the inputs of your desktop audio interface. Now let's set up another external audio source. For this example, I will be using the Roland SP404. Simply go from the line out, or headphone output of the SP404, to the inputs of the iPad audio interface. Same setup steps will apply with an AUM, since we are only changing the external audio source from the desktop DAW, to the Roland SP404. Now we have double the amount of effects that we can control, and record in real time. And I still have my MIDI controller, set up and ready to use to trigger Flytape 2's effects with an AUM. I hope you learned something new today. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.